Hello, my name is Mark Matthews with Sensor Networks, and today I'm going to give you an overview of the new HD PTZ system from Sensor Networks. What you see here is a natural technological improvement over past generations of standard definition PTZ cameras. So with this system, we've gone to a 1080p imager and transformed the entire internal chain of video handling. So what you'll see is a six time improvement over the standard definition products of the past. There are two configurations to this system. There's a desktop unit, which is not shown here on the table, and then a integrated reel system where we actually have the reel with the body of the controller. The system is capable of operating at zero to 120 degrees F, it is submersible to 100 feet, and the main cable, which you see here, can be extended to about 500 feet. What we have available is three different diameters, each with different optical characteristics. So on the table right now, with the integrated reel, is our largest head with also the largest optical zoom. So this is a 4.3 inch head capable of 30x optical zoom with 12x digital added on to that. Coming down from this head, we have a three and a half inch head, which essentially would match the barrel diameter that you see here. And with that three and a half inch head, you'll have a 10x optical zoom, 12x digital. And then just being introduced is a new three inch head, precisely 75 millimeters, that will also have the 10x optical with the 12x digital zoom. So the reel is comprised of a control panel, which would be used to control with this joystick, your pan, tilt, and also your home function. A second joystick, which would control some special functions, as well as your zoom um, controls and also focus, either manual or automatic. You have three dials in the front here. The left dial would control the onboard illumination, LED illumination, 2000 lumens. The center dial would actually control if you had the auxiliary lights either on the top, bottom, or both. And then a, a third um, dial that would help you to adjust the contrast to suit your needs depending on whether you're looking at something that's light or dark or a mix. So on this side of the panel on the left is an on off switch that's illuminated. You have um, one HDMI output and also your AC output for 115 volts. On the opposite side is a keyboard port as well as a second HDMI port. So on the back, you've got the reel, again, up to 150 feet on the reel, and behind the reel is a cradle to hold the camera head so everything is ready to be pulled out of the case and be utilized quickly. So the whole purpose of integrating this is to give you a compact, portable, lightweight, we're looking at 30 pounds total once we pull this out of the case for use quickly um, in the field. So real quickly uh, on these controls, left and right is your pan position. Up and down would be your tilt position. And then the blue button would give you a homing function that would take you to a place that you've predetermined. And you can set that very easily just by holding in the blue button where you want it to home out to. On the right side, we can now use this zoom function here and we can set it to automatically focus. And you can find position using the pan and tilt. It has a very fine control. Or if you push it hard to one side, it will actually accelerate quickly through the motions. So here we are zooming in. I'm gonna to go to a manual function for focus. And I'll position this a little bit more accurately there. And so you can see the detail in the threads and I will use this fine focus. 
So that's the controls. And then with the left and right, I mentioned the contrast. We can bring that down to give more detail in the dark or light areas. Okay, so here is your hard shipping case. And when you open it up, you'll have a lid with various pouches for strain relief, tools, extra parts, microphone, etc. And we have the reel system in here to pull it out. And all we have to do is hook up the AC, take the cable and hook that up to the back of the camera and put on the display and you're ready to roll. So in conclusion, what you have in the HDPTC system is a simple, intuitive inspection system enabling you to control pan and tilt easily and capture a video in 1080p, submersible to 100 foot, a robust construction that is made of aircraft aluminum with nickel coating and stainless steel. Thank you for watching.